can find our way up through there. After, you know, getting rid of those things. Can you read it? Yes, sir. That's funny. How so? One hand wrote, Yotnar only. And another wrote, and also doors. Should we add to it? No. The machinery in here looks almost dwarven. But the stonework, that's definitely <laughs> mind the mountain, actually lived here. It is a mountain. Big. Traps. There's a tunnel, but you won't fit. Take it. Okay. You okay? Of course. I can move it. It moves! And we're stuck. Cards still attached though. I see that. There. Let's go! 
Keep it up! Look at all this old stuff. If it is not useful, leave it alone. I know. Something special about them. I can feel it. Work it! Real 
work there. Why give us the way to the top? Follow me, Atreus. goes all the way to the top? We will see soon enough. Something feels strange up there. We're heading into danger. Do not concern yourself with what might be. Focus on what is, and be vigilant. Yes, sir. Not the top. Closer. Wait, that one's not broken. There's a note. A giant's prayer. They're asking their ancestors to watch over them. To guide them home. Boy. Wait. I think I know how it works. to watch of a mother. Do you think they'll watch over us on the way to the top? Come, boy. It is a long way up. Whoa! What's 
Stay back. The tunnel boy. Got it. Be careful. More tests. Wars must have carved these tunnels around the giant's traps. Good thing, too. Well, good for me, anyway. That is not helping. See you on the other side. Another mining room. May not be as long a way up as we thought. Summit. How far do you think we'll be able to see? The lake? The world serpent? Our house? We will see when we get there. Until then, eyes open. Whoa! Atreus! I'm fine. Just lost my balance for a moment. You know, for someone so strong, you sure worry a lot. It serves me well, and how I keep us alive. I guess. Not a terribly fun way to live, though. Is this where we get off? No, we are stuck. How much farther do we have to go? I do not know. Think we'll get attacked again? Definitely. Oh boy. Yes, now be ready.
again. I know. Is that a sap? Crystallized sap. And there is power inside. Incredible. I can't believe we fought a dragon. I was aiming for his eyes, but I kept losing my footing. Do you think this is their home? Did they move in after the giants left? Or are they why the giants left? Boy, the air grows thin here. No more questions. Breathe. Oh, yes. I see. Someone's screaming. Kill something that big? If we can catch it off balance. I can distract him. What are you doing? We have to help him. Break 
right. Find an angle. Wait for my mark. Thank you. to lower the crane on my mark. I do not care. Be ready.
actually did it. And you! Ah! Uh, but, 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 nobody's killed a dragon for hundreds of years! Not since the grand culling of the worms. And unless I'm mistaken, you did all that for me! You are mistaken. The dragon was simply in our path, nothing more. You deny it all you want, but you saved me, and that deserves compensation. What are these? Braided mistletoe arrows, straighter than Heimdall and perfectly weighted. Oh. Uh, thanks? Oh. Okay. Hold on. Uh, ooh, not that. Um, have you seen my brother again? Yeah, he said you lost your talent. <laughs> Oh, and that I'm selfish. No. I'm sure. That I value a weapon's look. No. Over its purpose. That I'm pretentious. No. And uptight. Fussy. I know what he thinks, but he can't hurt me any- Ah! Burn that. I do not have time for this. No. No. No, no, no. Wait. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. I have a better idea. What? I just need a tooth from that dragon. Watch where you grab that. Oh, ah, never mind. Oh, so unclean. Oh, so so unclean. Oh, oh, the smell. Perfect. That should do. Oh. Yeah. I am not touching that. Just hold it out. Now, run that along the string of your son's bow. Just humor me. Atreus, your bow. Two passes should do it. Ah, gently, now. Whoa! Oh, sure. Now you're impressed. Um... Oh, how do I explain this? I've added a new... Oh, I see. You figured it out on your own, then. Just... never mind. I wasn't just explaining the beautiful and complex artistry of my craft or anything. No, just... Anything to help you. Yep. Feels like it wasn't that long ago we were hunting deer. Now we fought dark elves, and trolls, and ogres, and a dragon. I feel like we could be anything now. We win because we are determined, disciplined, not because we feel ourselves superior. It's just, it feels good to be strong, you know? Yes, I know. Want me to shatter it? Oh, I'm gonna like this. Strange though. That one didn't completely blow up. That crystal. I shot it once, but it's going again. I see improvement.
I will never get tired of shattering things with this. Another one here. This one's called Emir. Mother tried to tell me this one, but I think I was too young. Are giants coming out of his armpits? I think that might be Odin stabbing him. Us to it's getting colder. We must be near the top. Not long now, Mon. River. Strap broke when we fought the dragon. It's all right. I can hold it. Stop. A broken quiver will slow your draw. Pain we endure. Faulty weaponry we do not. This will do for now. Good. Good. Hmm. Go. Steady, boy. Mind your footing.
I'm set. We did it. Those voices too, right? Yes. Be silent. You know why we're here. That sounds like the same man who came to our house. You said you killed him. Shh. I see you brought company this time. Must be important if the sons of Thor deign to grace me with their presence. Tell me, you two still tripping over yourselves to impress Daddy? The tattooed man. Tracks show he now travels with a child. Where would they go next? Why would I know that? You're the smartest man alive, aren't you? Smarter than all the dead ones, too. You help me, I help you. Tell me where they are, and I'll talk to Odin. Your father won't let me go, Baldur, and he won't let you kill me. You have nothing to offer me, so take your questions, take your threats, take these two worthless wankers, and... Piss off! When no one's looking, we'll be back for your other eye. Don't you forget, we're everywhere. We really are, aren't we? Ah, the very topic of conversation. A tattooed man traveling with a child. Boy, check their path. Make sure we're alone. But we just saw them leave. Do as I say. He doesn't know what you are. I would keep it that way. Who are you? Me? I'm the greatest ambassador to the gods, the giants, and all the creatures of the Nine Realms. I know every corner of these lands, every language spoken, every war waged, every deal struck. They call me Mimir, smartest man alive. And I have the answer to your every question. 
Why does the son of Odin hunt us? Okay, there are a few gaps in my knowledge. But Odin's had me imprisoned here for 109 winters. I'm a clever lad. I can piece it together. I promise. Just given time. Nobody there, just like I said. The boy's mother is dead. She wished her. She wanted us to spread her ashes on the highest peak in all the realms. Oh, then you've come to the wrong place, little brother. The highest peak in all the realms is not here in Midgard, it's in Jotunheim. Realm of the Giants. No! That could not be what she meant. Take a look. This is the last known bridge to Jotunheim in all the realms. See that mountain? Looks like a giant's finger scraping the sky. That's the highest peak in all the realms. No here. Can we just take that bridge? We have a Bifrost. When the giants destroyed all other bridges to their realm, they locked this one up with a secret rune. If it still exists, only a giant would know it. And all of them left Midgard a long time ago. True. But today, the winds of fate have kicked up a strange vortex of coincidence. Fact is, there's only one person alive who can get you where you need to go. And luckily for you, my schedule's wide open. We're going to Jodenheim, right? It's your best and only move from a tactical standpoint. It's the one place the man who cannot be killed won't follow you. What do we do? Yes! First, you need to cut off my head. Wait, what? And Odin made sure that no weapon, not even Thor's hammer, could free my body for these bonds. But fortunately, you don't need my body. The trick is, we need to find someone who can reanimate my head using the old magic. Old magic? Mm. There's a witch of the woods. She knows the old ways. And she'll help. She might do worth a try. But if she fails, he will be dead. He tortures me, you know. Every day, brother. Odin himself sees to it personally, and believe me, there is no end to his creativity. Every single day. This... This isn't living. Very well. Oh, I can't watch this. Brother. In case you can't resurrect me, there's something you need to know. Boy. The longer you wait to tell him his true nature, the more damage you do. He will resent you, and you may lose him forever. There is much about me I would not have him know. Uh, so you value your privacy more than your son? I'm going to cut off your head now. Fair enough. realm of the giants that's that's inconvenient yeah that's just what i was going to say soon we'll be able to translate those moose behind moons to the witch's house. Yes. The woods with the blood red leaves. South of the lake. I know just where to go. Hope she made it back from Alfheim and can bring Mimir back. He seemed nice. Before you cut off his head. I can't believe it was Balder that came to our house. The Acer go. 
Balder. And you fought him. And won! Yes. One of Odin's sons. Thor's brother. And now he's hunting us with his nephews. This is happening. If we can raise the head, you can ask him. Okay. You know, it's silly, but I secretly hope we find a giant somewhere in that mountain. I guess they really did leave Midgard. Except for the serpent. He may be the last of his kind. Are you the last of your kind, too? Is that why you don't like to talk about My the... kind? I mean, your family. Before Mother and I. Where you came from. Mother... a father? Now is not the time for that. Yes, sir. <laughs> Whoa. Fucking break! Don't hear me screeching at you whenever you're twiddling your short and curlies. Leave him, boy. No fat. Well, you already soiled my solitude, so you may as well join me. You're not hungry. Good. It's not what I was offering. Saw your brother again. Congratulations. And I'm sure you'll let him go and roger my axe good and plenty again, hmm? Let's see the damage. Mm, little canker throat wouldn't know proper weight and balance if it were dangling off his chut. Hmm. Do you eat well enough? I guess. Good. All better. Now what the fuck else you want, huh? Times he gets so wrapped up in his work, Sentry has it the sense to sip or suck. Then if he does remember... Boy, what is the path back to the witch? First we need to find a boat. Back to the witch from here. That way, behind the big statue of Thor. Want to try another story? It can't be any worse than the last one. Very well. There was a young man who was caught stealing and condemned to die. His mother came to visit his prison. She was a kind woman, who could only give love. But her son, the thief, met her with rage and bit off her ear. What? Why? Because the boy had always been a thief, and his mother had taught him only love and nothing of consequences. Had he been taught discipline instead, he might have lived longer. Sure, but her ear, that's not right. We could dock the boat here. Huh? The water dropped. And the serpent ran. Right. Move. I know she's really powerful. Do you really think the witch can bring a head back to life? She seems competent in her craft. And we have nothing to lose. If she can't bring it back to life, can we keep the head? No. But you may feed it to the fish. Okay. And now the door is gone. The witch's turtle must be standing up. So how do we get back up there?
I bet this will lead out. Turn back AC. Guess the guys aren't welcome here. <gasps> there he is! I hope he remembers us. How's it going, Charlie? Is your witch friend here? What is that name? That's what he told me it was. Or what it sounded like in my head, anyway. Charlie. Save their neat things upon Whoa. all who trust us. Can you read it? Yes, sir. Death to the Raven God, Lord of the Hang. She is here. It is so good to see you again. I knew you weren't dead. <laughs> Hello. Oh, can you bring your head back to life? Uh, I'm not sure I understand what... Wait. Where did you get those? The arrows. Give them to me. Now. They were a gift. Do as she says, boy. These arrows are dangerous. They're wicked. You find any more, you destroy them, understand? Do you understand? Say it! I understand. If I see them, I'll destroy them. It's all I ask. Forgive me. Please, take my arrows in their place. I have no need for them anymore. What's this about a head? <sighs> Do you have any idea who this is? Did you kill him? At his request. He claimed you could revive him. Me? Are you sure you heard him right? Please? <sighs> Take him to the table. Hey, Mille. It's been a long time since I've practiced the old magic. Hold him there. Let's have a look. Well, thankfully his head hasn't decayed much and his brain is still intact. Nice clean cut. 
cutting off his head of all people. I sure hope you know what you're doing. Now, hold his head under the water and don't let go. I mean it. That's enough. It worked! Let me see him. Mamir? You there? Yes. Good. Uh, oh. Hello, Freya. Been a long time. You look well. What I did, I did for them. As far as I'm concerned, death suits you better. I'd bow if I could, Your Majesty. Forgive me. Had I known the Witch in the Woods was Freya herself, I never would have suggested this. Freya? The goddess Freya? You didn't know either? Sorry. When word gets out that Mimir is free, the wrath of Odin won't be far behind. You are God. Leader of the Vanir, once yes, but no longer. You did not think it important to tell me. Are you really going to lecture me about that? We are leaving, boy. What? Now. You're welcome. Why did you do that? We cannot trust her. Because she's a god? Have I taught you nothing, boy? But she's helped us a lot. She lied. Some people value the privacy. Best not to judge, brother. When I require your counsel, Head, I will ask. Fair enough. Get me to Tyr's temple in the Lake of the Nine, and I'll get you to Jotunheim as promised. We know the temple. What's there? Only the last living giant in Midgard. Who better to tell us the way? The World Serpent? Wait, do you know how to talk to him? Indeed. He speaks an obscure tongue more ancient even than these mountains. None are left in Midgard who speak it. Except, of course, for me. You do? It's true. You wouldn't know it to look at him, but Jormungandr is a sparkling conversationalist. 